When using conversational analytics with a Looker Explorer, its performance, accuracy, and ability to answer questions is going to depend on the quality of the underlying LookML semantic model. So let's talk about some tips and best practices for getting the most out of conversational analytics. Conversational analytics captures the metadata from your LookML Explorer to answer data questions. It will be crucial to design your Explorer so that the LLM has clear, descriptive, and organized context. When building your Explorers in Looker, make sure that you have human-readable Explorer names, field names, and field labels. Get rid of those database names and make sure that any fields that are ambiguous are either hidden or you've added context to help the LLM determine which field to use. You can put that context in field descriptions or in the agent instructions if you're using an agent. You'll also want to take a look at your dimension field suggestions. These will be key for helping the LLM figure out which fields to use when a user wants to ask a question that requires a filter. Conversational analytics is actually pulling back some of the data using the field suggestions to understand which dimensions to use when filtering. So think about the LookML model as the lexicon that the LLM will use to figure out how to answer questions and make sure that you're designing your LookML model to serve that purpose. Also, keep in mind that some LookML features are not yet available in conversational analytics. So check out the docs online to see the specific LookML features that you might want to watch out for. As with any new tool that you plan to roll out in your organization, performance and user experience are key to user adoption. You'll want to make sure that any explorer that you are using with conversational analytics is optimized for, for performance so that users aren't waiting too long for their questions to come back. Most of the processing time in the tool will be from the time it takes the underlying database to run a query. Here are some quick tips to make your Explorer provide a great experience for users using conversational analytics. First of all, consider starting your testing of conversational analytics with smaller and less complex Explorers. Next, assure that fields that will be frequently used with filters have performant filter suggestion configurations. Use suggest dimension, suggest explore parameters in, order, in your LookML to improve the performance of the filter suggestions if necessary. Also, assure that all the tables in your Explorer are joined together efficiently. Probably try to avoid one-to-many or many-to-many -many joins if possible. These both slow down your query as well as increase the complexity of your Explorer and make it less reliable at answering questions efficiently. So LookML offers a number of features for improving your Explore performance overall. Uh, these include caching, PDTs, and aggregate awareness. You'll want to make sure you incorporate all of these best practices into your Explore design, both for conversational analytics, as well as your overall Looker performance. Uh, so first of all, make sure you're utilizing data groups to assure that results are cached for common queries. Materialize your derived tables as persistent derived tables uh, so that they're not being executed uh, when a user is asking a question. Consider creating aggregate tables. Um, you know, Looker has aggregate awareness to help roll up common metrics at a specific level of granularity. This will mean that when a user asks a question that can leverage these tables, it will not have to run the entire query for those aggregate tables uh, and should dramatically uh, increase the speed with which a user receives an answer. Lastly, we recommend that you test, test, test. So if you're seeing errors with conversational analytics, it actually might just be that your Explorer has invalid URL, uh, invalid LookML that is causing a SQL error. So we recommend that you test some common questions uh, and work to optimize the query speeds using the appropriate LookML and database techniques. Uh, using these techniques will not only make your conversational analytics experience better, 
but it will make your entire Looker experience more performant as well.